What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Hi, how are ya? Now today I am in Northern California, which is about six hours from Calabasas, and we're in the city of Mountain View. And you're probably like, girl, what the hell are you doing in a hotel? Well, today we are not only testing out some new products. I am going to the Vans Warp Tour, yes! So of course, here we are in 2019. It is the last time they're ever doing Warp Tour. So we are here to celebrate, of course, so Jeffree Star Cosmetics has a massive booth. I am doing meet and greets all weekend long, but there's a new foundation on the market, and bitch, we're trying it out today. Urban Decay has a brand new foundation on the market. It is called the Stay Naked Weightless Liquid Foundation. Now listen, this is, I'm really excited for this launch because we know that there has been so many foundations on the market lately, but Urban Decay, I live for them. They really bring it hard. So, this launch has over 49 shades. That's an amazing shade range, and the range is actually really good. Because there's a lot of brands now that are just making a bunch of foundations, but are the undertones good? Is the shade range correct? Urban Decay, yes, they came correct. So, today we will be trying this out, and it claims for you guys for real, 24 hours. Now, I would never wear a foundation that long, but you know what? I want to really try this. So, I figured we're on a tour bus today. This is going to be really fun. So, you guys, let's dive in and let's apply this product. Also, we have the brand new Stay Naked Urban Decay Concealer. So, we're going to be applying both of those and we're going to see what the hell happens to my face today. All right, before we apply, let's dive in into the product details. Now, this foundation retails for $39. That's pretty good for an Urban Decay product. It's very, of course, it's high-end-ish. It's in Sephora. Um, now, this has one fluid ounce. That is 30 ml, very standard for a foundation size, so I love that. Um, packaging is cute. It's different. It has this kind of like plastic piece that's kind of um, missing. The packaging is giving me very like business chic, um, I love it. It looks very professional and just very like upscale. When you open it up, it has of course this cap on it and it is a pump, which I live for, thank God. Um, so I just want to kind of dive in and go with it. Now I grabbed three shades and I think this one's going to match me the most. This is 20NN. Now the cool thing about this launch is you guys, there is so many undertones, which I think is really, really important. So if you go on their website, it really has a whole array of how to find your shade. This coverage is allegedly medium the formula is vegan it's buildable it is a liquid of course and it has a real skin matte finish that of course it says lasts up to 24 hours it's good for normal dry combination and oily um, of course this brand is cruelty free and i think it's time to shut our mouth and apply all right now i have already prepped my skin today um, i was of course driving from calabasas all the way up here in a tour bus we've been up here for a few days hanging out with the jeffree star crew um, so i woke up today really early got my face snatched and ready. So of course, you know, we primed with the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base. Um, my go-to, really good. Now, if you need another primer for yourself or you need something else to happen, girl, apply and do you. And of course, we got a star mirror here. Whew, I need some foundation on the skin. So I'm just gonna put this on my hand. Are we supposed to shake it? I don't know what to do. Ready, Christian, let's do this. <laughs> I'm gonna do two pumps and just see what happens. Ooh, okay. So that's what it looks like. Okay, on the more thicker consistency, which I live for. Ooh, okay, as you see, it's not dripping crazy down my hand, so it is a little more of a thicker consistency, which I live for. Now, I am gonna go in with a damp beauty sponge. This is the Morphe Jeffree Star um, collaboration. Hi. <gasps> That's a lot, or is it? I don't know, I don't know how much to use. Now I do want to remind you guys that we literally are in front of a window in a hotel room right now, so if the lighting is a little weird, you guys know the drill. All right, let's apply. <gasps> oh! Oh, it smells very fresh. You guys know I love to smell everything. Not bad, really just kind of smells like foundation. All right. Whoa, okay coverage, how you doing? Okay, so far, I'm like, whoa, it's looking pretty on the skin. Obviously, I just applied it. Now, it did say medium. It didn't say this was supposed to be full, so I'm not sure if I want to add a second layer, how I'm feeling. Let me see. All right, I'm going to do half my face, and then we'll really see how we're feeling. So let me just do a little line down there. Whoa, okay. 
in this lighting. I don't know how the undertone of the foundation is looking. To me, it looks good. Um, but look at half my face. Hi, over here it's looking a hot mess. But the coverage is actually really good. I'm pleasantly surprised. Whoa, okay, it didn't get cakey. It's not weird. It, it went really nice on the skin. Madison, boom. Yes. We need you to come in here, girl. Right, I'm not my assistant. One of my is makeup artists come in here. Okay, come over here behind the camera. Let me see. I did only half my face. Opinions oh. for real. Ooh. Wow. I like that. It's good, huh? Yes. But what do you think for real? Like, be brutal. I think it looks dope. It's definitely... <gasps> Room service. Room service is here, of course. <laughs> it's definitely medium to full coverage. Yeah, it looks sure. good, huh? Whoa, I think it looks drastic because I haven't done this side yet too, which is exactly what I wanted to show off. But I'm like, for a, like a matte foundation, she's giving me life. She's pretty. It so looks far. pretty on your skin. It does, huh? Whoa. But is it going to wear? In an hour, it could be falling off. I could look like The Walking Dead. So, okay, let me finish this. Room service is here, but we're gonna, we're gonna power through. So let me, I guess, do the rest of my face. Hi. So we're gonna take some more of that. You never know what to expect with the foundation review, and baby, let's see what happens. Whoa, okay, foundation is on. Let's give a real first impressions. Let's let it just sit here for a second. And of course you guys know we have the concealer to try on next, girl. So, okay, so far, looking in the mirror. Whoa, okay. I'm a little shook right now. My skin's looking good. Like, nothing settling in my fine lines. My cre Like, nothing's creasing. Um, cute, okay, now. So far, so good, but we all know we have a whole day of testing. <laughs> so let's put on the Stay Naked Concealer. Now I have four shades here. Usually I go for the lightest because a lot of brands don't ever make a really good light, light shade. Urban Decay, they definitely do, but let's see. This is 10NN, so this actually matches the foundation. I don't know if I, maybe I want a different shade. And then there's 10CP. So let's open her up. And when you open it, it says, good things happen when you're naked. T, I'm naked right now. Ooh, okay, so here is the two lightest shades. This is what they look like. I'm definitely gonna have to swatch them on my hand before we uh, look at them. So let's do 10 CP. Whoa, the applicator is dope. Look at that, you guys. Woo. It's like a weird kind of bent type of moment that's probably gonna get right in there. All right, and this one is 10 NN. So let me see what these look like. Ah, huh. They kind of look very similar, but I think this one is lighter on this side. What do you think, Chris? A little lighter on that side, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. All right, so the Stay Naked Concealer, before we apply it, let's talk about it real quickly. Now this guy retails for $29, and there is 0.35 ounces in here. Now there is over 24 shades, a uh, very big shade range, really good um, undertones for this brand, of course. It's vegan, it's demi-matte, it is full coverage liquid concealer with 25% pigment, bitch, okay? Um, it's vegan, cruelty-free. It says how to use. Girl, we know how to use. But this is a, oh, it says a patent wave tip applicator. Makes it easy to get the right level of coverage. Use the flat side for precise light application or lean into the curve for a heavier dose. I love that. Okay, cool. Well, is it going to work though, bitch? That's the question. Okay, guys. Ooh, yeah, we're just going to go with 10 and N as well. Let's just start with one eye and see in case it gets crazy. So we're just gonna do a little bit right there. Oh yeah, this is light, bitch. We're gonna take it all the way right here. Now I don't know how it's gonna look, so I don't wanna go overboard and it like, <laughs> we all know what happens sometimes when you put too much concealer on. So let's take the sponge and let's buff. Okay, so far it's blending out nice. It's not getting like clumpy or dragging it's actually blending out really pretty whoa okay that was really easy that took about mm, five seconds got it love how that looks i want to add a little bit more i think my face is telling me jeffrey you're a full coverage queen a little bit more hi chin how you doing bitch and then we'll go over here hopefully it's not fast drying or we're Oh, 
Okay, concealer is fully blended out. Yes, um, it's actually really pretty. I, I didn't know what to expect, but my skin is like. <laughs> it laid really nice. It didn't um, settle weird. Now, of course, we do need to set it. So I am going to use the classic Laura Mercier Invisible Setting Powder. Hi, how are you? This one is just such a classic, and it is in my makeup bag. Hi. So we're just going to use our Damp Beauty sponge, of course. And let's set anywhere where we put the concealer and let's pray that it uh, looks good. All right, translucent powder is set. I am gonna take a little JSC Morphe Jeffrey powder brush and just dust off anywhere where I put that powder. They're looking very good right now. Really happy with how these products applied. I never know what is going to happen. And especially it's a little scary when you have to do a meet and greet later and actually meet people and you're like, uh, what if this flops later? So, oh, Jesus Lord. Okay, um, let's have some room service and then we're gonna get dressed and head on over to the venue. Um, and we're gonna be doing check-ins all day. So, what do you guys think so far? All right, everything is fully set. It's time for a meal. Um, it's really early in the morning, by the way. It's only 8 a.m., so I will have this foundation on until tomorrow, Sunday morning, 8 a.m. <sighs> Cheers. Whew. Okay, everybody, the rest of my face has been complete, and the foundation and concealer, they're holding up, y'all. They're really holding up. I really don't see anything wrong. I'm like, okay, it's been uh, an hour and a half. We had a full breakfast, full transformation, and everything is pretty good so far. All right, I didn't want to set the face yet because I figured I'd have to use Urban Decay. This is the new summer solstice version of the All Nighter. I've been using this forever on my channel. I already know that it works, but I'm not gonna go overboard. This is a review and we want to make sure the product really has its moment, whether it flops or is a hit. Oh, hi, fresh bottle. So I'm gonna lightly set the skin. <sighs> that smells really good, actually. All right, now let's get dressed and get to the venue, the meet and greet, I think. What time is it now? Okay, guys, it is 12. Oh my God, it's been hours since this morning, you guys. We took a very long break. Everything is actually looking pretty good. You tell me, has anything synced in? Does anything look crazy? Only thing that I'm noticing is maybe right there, but you know, that could just be old age or um, anger. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, let me get dressed and we will head off to the venue right now. I need to get my ass in gear. All right, we are back at the tour bus. I'm gonna ask Nate how the fuck my face looks. And um, we're here at Warp Tour. Hello everybody, welcome to our tour bus. Hey, dude! Yes! Hey! How are you doing? I'm good, you? <sighs> good. Okay, we did our review. I know, I'm like... Let me ask you, let me ask you a question. Let me put this down. Hi, skateboard. How are you doing? Will you teach me how to skateboard for a video? Yes, I would love to. <laughs> First time I break my neck. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I'm trying. Oh my god, look at all the fans outside! Yes! Hi, subscribers! How are you doing? Tinted windows, they can't see us. But this is the start of our line. Look at my booth over there. Can you see that, Christian? Holy yeah. shit. Oh my god. Yes. Okay, Nate. So, I am trying on a foundation and a concealer. Where's the star mirror, y'all? Yes. There we go. All right, Nate. Where could Nate look at good lighting? Maybe you sit there. All right, for real. Obviously, you've seen my skin every day for four and a half years. How um, is it looking? Yeah, it looks nice. I mean, it really, I mean, it looks like almost like your normal, like the stuff you would use, you know. Like my normal routine. Yeah. How does it look? Is it smooth? Is it cracky? It's very it... smooth. It's almost like it's like muted or like, I don't know, it's like a soft. I don't know. It looks nice. I don't know. It's not like super glowy, but it's like, it's like matte. It's like super. All right, Nathan. Tutorials. I'm just thinking. <laughs> it looks like that. Yeah. I like it. I haven't even peeked, so let me do the check-in as well. Yeah, that's pretty good. I like it. It's really good, actually. I was a little shook, because you never know, obviously, what's ever gonna happen. All right. And so far, so good. Obviously, this is the 24-hour challenge. <laughs> Which is a little scary. So, we're, what, two, three, four hours in, and um, so far, so good. Yeah, I like it. Thanks, babe. Yeah. Um, okay, you guys, I have to change my clothes, and then in an hour, we are headed out there. So let's see how the foundation and concealer looks in another hour, and then we're gonna be melting in the sun all day. 
work. Oh, okay, I think I picked my outfit, a little baby spice moment, a little platform shoes. Hi. Um, I definitely need some body bling, so we're gonna go with a little liquid frost. Hi. <laughs> and <sighs> yes. Gotta keep it icy out here. Alright, you guys, we are 30 minutes away. We'll do a check-in right before and then one at the end. And let's pray this face don't crack. about to start the signing. We'll do a check-in in a minute, but my skin is feeling really good right now. That's what I'm hearing. My dress might pop up a little bit. Nate will have to keep my coochie in check today. signing for about an hour now. I have Stacy here. Hi, gorgeous. Hi. First of all, what lip are you wearing? A uh, watermelon soda. It looks amazing. Thank yes. You. Okay. So, she knows that I'm doing a review and you asked me how it was doing, right? Yeah. So, I want to ask you. So, I'm doing a full foundation and a concealer, New Urban Decay. Do you live for it on me or hate? Sound no, off. It, it looks so good. Like, there's like no creasing. The pores are covered pretty good. Minus that one eyeliner dot right there. <laughs> Excuse me, but okay. So, how are we feeling? Increasing coverage. Uh, a little bit right here in the smile lines, but yep. like on the under the eyes, it's so good. Whoa. Okay, you heard it here first from <laughs> Stacy. We're in Mountain View. Signing off. We'll see y'all in a little bit. Okay, this has been on for nine hours. Like, really no creasing. Skin is looking really good. Um, it feels all right, it doesn't feel weird. Overall, from being in that 90 degree weather for hours, like, what do you think, Nate? Come over here. <laughs> it still looks good to me, I mean. Like that one girl though said, I mean, get a little creasing there, but it's not bad. I oh, guess. what Miss Stacy said? Mm -hmm. she, she, she kept it real with me. I appreciated it. Okay, yeah, just a little creasing right here, Christian. Look at right there. Mm -hmm. I, like that wrinkle. Just a I, bit. We're gonna have to just embrace her. Hi, future. All right, you guys, I'm gonna wipe this off, change, and uh, be right back. <sighs> Hi, everyone. Okay, we got an outfit change. Yes. It's getting a little chilly out. I had to put my hair back. Girl, she's lit. Okay, so let's look at my skin. First of all, 
It's been over 12 hours and my face does not hate me yet. It feels really good. Um, I always think about like, does my face feel like it has makeup on? And it really doesn't. Only thing that's feeling a little heavy is my contacts and lashes from getting a little uh, stoned. Um, but I'm looking at my skin and I'm like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Urban Decay. 12 hours in, bitch. We're intact, like you guys, look. A little creasing around the nose, like right here, hi. I was smiling all day, I met like a thousand people, so I'm not shook that it's a little creasy right here, but for a foundation for 12 hours, and let's talk about the concealer. Hi, pretty good. Like, for 90 degree weather, 12 hours in? Okay, work. Oh, these lights are fucking brutal. Oh, look at all the moths. Whoa, bitch, how are we feeling? How, for real? The lights are It looks thickening still. Wait, why has it not cracked or done anything weird? A little hair only. Like a little around my nose, but girl, we're on past 12 hours. Yeah. It's like 14 hours now? Bitch. 13, yeah. 14, 13, 16, 20. <laughs> whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. How are we feeling for real? It looks, it looks so good. good. <laughs> like, I, I want to use foundation for like a few more times. Whoa. Yeah, it looks good. We're past the 12 hour mark, everyone. The sun is officially setting. Warp Tour is dying down. There's like one or two bands left. Let's run through the venue. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Looking like a fucking highlighter. I just want to see how we're feeling. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> My eyes are so red. Listen, bathrobe going on. <sighs> Christian, I am so tired. <laughs> okay, ready? Yeah, let's do it. Oof. Batty lashes, IG work. Okay, my eye is like twitching the house. Okay, ready for this? Remember everyone, if you have nails and you have contact lenses, ready for the trick? Hi, it's out, how are ya? Okay, contacts are out, lashes are off. Do I look like shit? Be honest, tell me. No, no, I think the fun Whoa. is good. It looks good. Yeah, it does. Sorry guys, I'm trying to not be in the shadows right now, but. Whoa. And the concealer. Okay, it is one in the morning. That is 17 hours. <laughs> Hi, I'm tired. <laughs> How are ya? Okay, for 17 hours though, this is crazy. The concealer is like... Ow. Okay. Very impressed. I'm like, work. Foundation. Now listen, you guys. Like I said, around the nose, it is what it is, right? Very normal, I think. But for like 17 hours, whoa, she's impressed. So far, so good. Um, I don't know what to do. Everyone is still um, having a little after party outside, so I might go uh, chill for a minute. But um, what should I do? Should I like just sleep on my pillow? I mean, I guess you just face sure. up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. Um, I don't know, man. Okay, I really. <laughs> I gotta figure this out. So I will be back and let's see what happens. No, it's time for a check-in, dude. You think so? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Right. Where's Jeffrey? He's sleeping right now, I think. Oh, damn, okay. Let's check this out. Christian, I hate my life. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. 
Christian, I need to, hold on. Oh my, oh fuck, look at this eyeliner pouring out of my eye. Y'all are covering like an episode of Cops, like, <laughs> I feel like the drunk bitch y'all are opening, like waking up. Yeah. On the episode. What you gonna do when they come for you? How's oh. it feel? Like I don't have anything on. Really? Yeah. That's dope. Does the pillow look bad? No. Mm-mm. There's a drool stain. Got it. Woo! What the hell did I set up for? <laughs> okay. Let's fucking look at my skin. I need to go back to sleep. Okay. For 2 a.m. Are y'all shook a little bit or no? It looks still really good. Like, listen, I've tried foundations where, like, after eight hours, it looks like... I don't know what happened. We've seen some brutal things on this channel before, but okay, for real, because I really want to go back to sleep. The concealer looks sickening. Um, foundation looks good. My face looks smooth. I'm shocked. Okay, I see a little bit of pores. I've been sleeping. Your face opens up while you sleep. Great. Um, but yeah, overall, it's pretty damn good. Like, I would love to wipe this off, but we have how more? Six more hours to go. Just a couple. Great. Well, I'm gonna roll over and uh, I'll see you in bed in a minute. Yes, you <laughs> should. Good night. Okay. <sighs> okay, good morning. Can we turn up the air? It's so loud. Hi. Okay, we're turning the air off so you guys can hear me. We're on tour. We're waking and baking, honey. Okay. Christian, when y'all woke me up, what, <laughs> one hour ago, 60 seconds ago? When was that? Hours ago? Like I was traumatized, Maddie. <laughs> okay, let's talk about it for real. How j Whoa, I have sparkle all over. I was probably rubbing my eyes last night. It's been 24 hours. My skin around the nose looks a little crazy. But, like, the rest of my face... Looks pretty damn good. What do you think, Christian? Yeah, that's actually surprisingly good. Surprisingly? Oh my god, my skin is dying. I brought the foundation, the concealer, I brought the wipes ready to remove this before today's event. Hi, Sunday, how are ya? I mean, we could really zoom in a little bit. Hi. Insecure? Don't fucking care. Show these pores, honey. Um, I mean, the eye makeup, yeah, it crumbled, but this isn't about the eye makeup review. Like, hi, I rubbed my eyes all night. The mascara was like, good morning. It looks good, you guys. It does. I'm kind of shocked. I'm like, oh my. And I would never wear foundation this long. So, hi. It survived a rock show. It survived crazy heat in this weather. Um, Urban Decay. Hi, how you doing? You really did that. I'll say that right here. The Stay Naked uh, Correcting Concealer. I might like it more than the foundation, I'm going to be honest. It did not crease. Like, how did my under eyes look like this? So bomb. I'm like, girl, I'm gonna wake in, I like waking and baking, girl, and it's still nothing's wrong. I'm shook. I'm ready to go back to bed. I'm also ready to remove everything. But this is a fun video. I can't believe I survived it. <laughs> First of all, if you're someone that regularly sleeps in your makeup, can't relate. Stop! Right now, take care of your skin, please, or I'm going to come through that screen right now. Um, okay, let's get to it. I think it's time for the very, very final thought. The Urban Decay Stay Naked Foundation and Concealer are Jeffree Star approved! Yes! Listen, this was a crazy journey. These products, ingredients are amazing because, I'm, I'm, I mean, that's it, shook. That should be the title of the video. I'm shook, hi. Um, all right, you guys, <laughs> hello, hello, hello. I need this makeup off, I love you guys. Sound off below, what do you think of the product? Um, give me your feedback, I love you guys. I will see you on the next video, mwah. Good night.